Hey guys, so today on my channel, we're going to be filming a Bath & Body Works Sandman annual haul. I went today and I picked up a bunch of stuff. Today was the first day of the sale, so I had to go before everyone went. <laughs> so I did pick up a lot, a good amount, not like three giant bags fulls, but at least one big bag full and two little ones. So we're going to start off with the soap. Do not mind my nails. I know there are three different shades of nail polish because I was trying out nail polish I'm sorry so we're gonna start off with the soap and I did pick up some like fruity scents and then some warmer scents because I know fall is coming up and I do stock up on soap for a few months just so I don't have to keep going back when they're not on sale so the first one that I picked up is midnight blue citrus this is one of the normal ones I believe they have this all year round at least i think so this one smells incredible they have it in candles it's just like a very strong citrus scent so i decided to go ahead and pick that up the next one that i got is mango mai tai i love the packaging on this one it's super cute so mango mai tai is exactly what it smells like it smells like mango sun kissed grapefruit and sugar cane it's super good if you're into mango scented anything pick this up you'll love it so the next one I picked up guys is watermelon lemonade. Love this scent. They have it all year round. Self-explanatory. It smells like watermelon lemonade. Alright. So the next one I picked up I got two of. And that is Beautiful Day. Love this scent. It smells like flowers and citrus. Such a perfect scent. I believe they have this in body splashes and lotions. I'm not 100% sure but I feel like I'm 95% sure. <laughs> let me see this pick it up because this is a perfect all year round scent i love beautiful day they should have a body wash lotion spray all that good stuff the next one i picked up is my transition to fall scent <laughs> which is a pink petal tea cake this one smells incredible it smells like rose petals and vanilla and cake and it's just incredible you guys do have this at your bath and body works for the sale pick it up because it's a perfect transition transition sense can't pronounce my s's sometimes guys because i'm hispanic it's because i'm hispanic <laughs> so the next one i picked up is two of the same oh no little battery I picked up two of the same, which is the Boardwalk Vanilla Cone. Last year, I picked up four of these, and I remember they were either yellow or blue, the soap. So this year, I only picked up two, but I do love this. I always pick it up when I see it. It's a perfect vanilla scent. You can never go wrong with vanilla. Vanilla. You can never go wrong with vanilla <laughs> unless you hate vanilla. And I know a lot of people don't like vanilla scented things or anything sweet, so go pick it up if you don't like that. All right, so we have three more left and two of them are doubles. But the one that's not a double is Blueberry Crumble. And I could have sworn I picked up another one of these, but I didn't. This one smells incredible. Now, if you don't like sweet stuff or you don't like blueberries, stay away from this because it smells exactly like the picture, like a little blueberry pie. You can obviously smell the crust and everything. It smells so good. So if you guys don't like blueberries, don't pick it up. It says, um, fresh blueberries, brown sugar glaze, and a dash of cinnamon. It smells incredible. So these are going to be used around September when it's starting to get towards that fall season. So I have something to kick off fall with. All right. So the next two are cinnamon sugar donuts. Love this scent. I believe they have this or they did have it in a candle. I don't remember but i know around fall time they had like a sugary donut scented candle and i loved it so i picked it up in a soap it's going to be perfect for the kick off the fall time as well so i picked up two of them it smells incredible i'll give you guys the keynotes it says old-fashioned donut crushed nutmeg and white cinnamon it smells super yummy so that is it with the soap i believe we got 11 soaps here so that's a lot of soap I calculated by two soaps a month, so hopefully it lasts that long. But if it doesn't, it's okay. That gives me more reason to have more fall scents. Yes. All right, so next we're gonna move on to body wash. I only picked up five body washes because I do still have a couple of them. 
Um, so for body wash, the first one I picked up is Dark Kiss. I picked up two of these. You can never go wrong with Dark Kiss. It's like a nice, perfect nighttime sultry scent, either to go to sleep or if you're going out. Um, the keynote is Black Raspberry, Burgundy, Rose, Bur Bergamot, Incense, Dark Vanilla Bean, and Plum Mask. Musk. Oh my gosh. Plum Musk. <laughs> so yeah, I love this scent. This always comes out around any semi-annual sale. They always bring out their oldies and this is always one of them. I really miss... What is that one called? Secret Wonderland. Do you guys remember Secret Wonderland? Comment down below if you do. I love the, that scent. And this is like the closest I can get to it. So if you guys remember that, comment down below. I want to see if you guys do. So the next scent that I picked up is a lot softer. It's Pink Cashmere. The keynotes on this one is Pink Jasmine Petals, Creamy Sandalwood, White Amber, and Cashmere Musk. I had this in a splash and I like it in a splash, but I was like, I think I'll like it better as a body gel. You know, some things are just meant to be in others, <laughs> not the other ones. So this one I feel like will be a perfect body gel scent. Now, the next one I got super fruity scents for you guys that love fruity scents. It's Sun Ripened Raspberry. And then the keynotes on this one is Sun Ripened Raspberries, Strawberry Leaves, and Sugar Crystals. So this one smells exactly like raspberries and a little bit of strawberry I feel but it smells super fruity so if you guys are into those kind of scents definitely pick this one up it smells incredible and then the last one I got is Endless Weekend this one is so good I should have picked up two I don't know why I didn't but it has um Sunkissed Magnolia Raspberry Lychee Sorbet if I'm pronouncing that wrong I'm sorry and a breeze of blue coconut water and vanilla sandalwood so it smells just like honestly like summer it smells like a weekend in the summertime it smells incredible it smells fruity but it has a little bit of like that fresh clean scent to it as well so if you guys like those fresh clean scents you'll definitely like this because it has like a dash of like fruity smell all right so i picked up this aromatherapy focus eucalyptus and tea i had this one in a hand sanitizer and i really loved it has a great scent to it and I feel like it's perfect for work so if you guys work in the office and it has like a little pump too so you just kind of have it on your desk pump it out um I picked this one up just for that just to bring it to work help me focus sometimes you just need a little bit of help focusing at work and your co-workers just being annoying I'm just kidding <laughs> no but this one smells really good I really do like it if they had sleep I would have picked up 85 of the sleep ones because I'm in love with the sleep aromatherapy line the candle, the body wash, the, just anything. Sleep is so good. And story time, when we first got there, there was like no one in the store. And then I don't know where it got super overcrowded. And there was this one lady that had a bag and she was just opening all the drawers on the bottom and just taking everything that was in there and just stuffing her bags and like sending this other girl with her bags put in the front. It was crazy. And then the lady had one of the one of the workers had one of those blue you know bath and body works bags filled with these that they were going to start putting out into the little boxes and that lady <clears throat> did not even let her put them into the boxes she just grabbed the whole bag and just started dumping it into hers and left like four and everybody was just like what so then we're just going through the bins and then this other lady came out of nowhere um, she was a worker and she was like starting to put a bunch of these out again. I'm like, oh my gosh, you guys found more. She's like, no, the lady didn't even take them. <laughs> so I was like, what the heck? You guys will find some really funny people at Bath and Body Works that I go crazy. The next one I picked up, which I fell in love with, is Boardwalk Marshmallow Clouds. If you guys love Marshmallow Fireside Candle, I promise you guys, this is Marshmallow Fireside in a lotion. It smells identical to it, and that's the reason I picked it up. When I first smelled it, I was like, oh my gosh, Marshmallow Fireside. So I'll tell you guys the keynotes. It says whipped vanilla, marshmallow meringue, white magnolia, and fluffy sandalwood. If you guys love Marshmallow Fireside, I promise you guys you'll love this. So I picked this up. I love anything vanilla marshmallow scented ice cream scented anything sweet i'm like a sweet scented girl that's why i probably love fall scents so much because that's when they come out with all their sweeter scents so yeah 
And the next one I picked up is this one and I love the packaging of this one. Kind of looks like it came from like their Christmas collection, but I'm not 100% positive because I didn't see this around Christmas time. If you guys did, comment down below just because I'm super curious to see if they had this around Christmas time because I didn't see it. So this one is wrapped in sugar soft marshmallow. So when I picked this up, I'm like, oh my gosh, another marshmallow one. And then I smelt it and it smells like coconuts. So I was so thrown off, but on the back, it says coconut martini, marshmallow musk, and soft amber and warm woods. Well, I was like, oh, that's strange. So I smelled it again and it actually smelled really, really good. I know that with Bath & Body Works, I always try to get a coconut scent, but they're like coconut scent. So it smells so fake and artificial. So this one actually smelled really good just because I think it was mixed with like that sweeter marshmallow scent. So if you guys do not like their coconut scents because it smells super artificially or fake or whatever, Pick this one up if you guys have it in your semi-annual sale because I know you'll love it. I love it. It smells incredible. So we're going to move on to these two little things and then we'll move on to the candles. I got four candles and then I got two of these little um, wallflower scents. So I got two, only two, just because I wasn't planning on picking these up, but I needed to add something to my purchase to hit that 40. So I picked two of these up. I got the mahogany teakwood scent and then I got cactus blossom. Cactus Blossom smells like a beautiful spa. There's something about Cactus Blossom that it keeps me coming back. I bought it in the candle scent. Now I want to buy it in every scent. It smells incredible. Now the last four things are candles. And we'll go ahead and start off with the two that I was hunting down. So I went in there with the mission to find these two candles. And there was a bunch of them. So I was like, whatever. All that work for nothing. <laughs> No, but before the sale started, I did look online to see what candles I wanted to buy. And these two intrigued me a lot. And I saw a lot of posts about these on Instagram too. Because I do follow a couple Instagram um, accounts that love Bath & Body Works. So the first one that I was super curious about was Summer Boardwalk. It was made with essential oil. So I was like, oh, I wonder what that smells like. Now what threw me off were the keynotes. Because the keynote says... Caramel glazed popcorn, popcorn, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> caramel glazed popcorn, warm taffy apples, sweet cream with essential oils. So it threw me off because popcorn and apples and cream, I was like, that's a weird combination, weird mixture. So I was like, all right, let me get there, we'll smell and see if we like it. I love this scent. If you guys are into fall scented things, this one smells like obviously fall it has caramel it has apple it has sweet cream so it's perfect i love it if you guys hate apple scented things i know that with this one it has like a nice crisp apple scent to it so don't pick it up if you don't like apples but it does have a lot of that caramel and sweet cream in it i feel like this one's gonna smell up my house and i really hope it does because i love these kind of scents the next one i picked up is saltwater taffy i love the packaging on this one it's super cute so this one it says chewy vanilla cream fresh berries and juicy cherry with essential oils as well and this one smells like a strawberry laffy taffy it smells super good so if you guys are into the sweet scents but you're not into like you know vanilla buttercream all those super sweet scents this is a perfect scent for you guys i love it so much so i'm excited to burn this one now I did pick one up that's not sweet. I don't only buy sweet candles except for the last one. You guys are gonna be like, oh my gosh, what the heck? But this one is Sundress. There's a story about this one. So every single time I would go to Bath and Body Works during springtime, I would see this, want it, never pick it up. And I had a coworker that would talk about this and tell me how good it smells and it smells and I was like, oh my God, I need to buy it. And every time I would go, I would find something else and never pick it up. So. When I was at the sale, I saw that there was two left and I was like, today is the day where I'm taking this one home with me. <laughs> so I did. If you guys are into like those manly scents, this one is exactly like that. It just smells like men's cologne. It smells incredible. I love it. Um, which is really weird. It throws me off. Beautiful packaging, super girly, sundress, and it smells like men's cologne. But it's okay. I'm with it. I love it. And I'm excited to burn it. It kind of reminds me of mahogany apple. So if you guys smelled that around summertime, I believe it was in like a green packaging, mahogany apple, it smells just like it. 
It has crisp pear, sparkling white wine, fresh apples, and oak wood. Yeah. So it reminds me a lot of mahogany apple. Now the last one is a typical Demire sense. <laughs> Um, I love cocoa zinc cream. I believe cocoa zinc cream comes out around fall time. It comes out for Halloween. It comes out disguised in winter scents. It comes out disguised in Easter. And Lord and behold, I saw Happy Easter and I was like, yes, I know this one is the this is chocolate bunny scented candle. And honestly, it's cocoa zinc cream. It has the keynotes are decadent milk chocolates, fresh steam milk and mini marshmallows so it's honestly just cocos and cream just disguised and repackaged little bunnies on top so if you guys love that scent and you guys see this don't think it's like a like a flowery scented candle no this is cocos and cream so pick this up i love it i had butterscotch toffee in my bag and i was like oh my gosh i left this um i left that one and got this one because i love cocos and cream so i'm really happy that I found that concludes my semi-annual haul. I'm sure I would probably most likely going to be back to buy more things. So I did want to pick up a couple more sprays, some lotions, maybe some more candles. <laughs> I do want some more candles. And I know it's June now. And I know at the end of July, the fall scents come back on. So I'm ready for <laughs> you want to see more videos like this one go ahead and subscribe comment down below and let me know what kind of videos you would like to see in this channel i really want to start doing um unboxing videos just because i am subscribed to ipsy and boxy charm so if you guys want to see that like this video or comment down below and let me know and i'll start doing those um as well as more vlogs if i go on any trips or anything like that and challenge videos i really want to do some of those challenge videos going around right now so if you guys have any suggestions on which one I should do comment down below and other than that I'll see you guys in my next video bye